Hi loves, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Simisi K. If you're new here, a very warm welcome to you. If you're a returning subscriber, Baby, welcome to the party. Uh, I'm off the Myers in the lead. That's why I'm over a top. Anyways, guys, um, so, um, today's video is going to be a vlog. Um, it's going to be a vlog, and I'm taking you guys with me to Johannesburg. Um, Johannesburg slash PTA. PTA slash Johannesburg. Yeah. Um, I'm going to like um, a very very spiritual conference and I'm pretty excited so um, yeah I'll take you guys through with me and um, I hope you guys really do enjoy this vlog um, please do give it a thumbs up because it's gonna be a good one it's gonna be a good one so yeah so yeah guys let's get right into it let's get right into it <laughs> Hey guys, I'm looking so bad right now. Got to rush out and all of that. But we're on our way to our flight and <sighs> so late, so late. I recognize your fragrance. Hold up, you ain't never gotta say shit. Uh, and I know your taste is a little bit mm, high maintenance. Uh, everybody else basic. You live life on an everyday basis with poetic justice. Hi guys, so we're at the airport in Johannesburg right now. We're just waiting for Umushe and then from here we're gonna head to the Khao train and then from the Khao train we head to the event and um, yeah so I'm gonna catch you guys there because right now we're in a rush. We don't know if we're late, we don't know if we're gonna catch the the Ikhao train on time. There's just a lot going on so yeah, see you guys then. Nigga don't approach up with that Atari Nigga that ain't good game home is sorry They say conversation Rule a nation I can tell But I could never write my wrongs Unless I write it down for real P.S. at the conference it was so beautiful like i'm acting orcs now because obviously like vlogging is just like awkward in um public but in jay it was such a great event um i got a message jay i'm um, like i've gained a lot from just coming here so like no regrets at all it's like 15 it's like quarter past it's like quarter past three now and um, we are about to go to Goddess Cafe, which is still around here, I think. Um, but yeah, guys, like I'll tell you guys more about it, like when I'm um, settled and all of that, because right now I'm just like trying to snip snap because like I haven't been speaking to you guys. So yeah, so that's it. Now waiting for our Uber, then we're gonna go to Goddess Cafe, and then yeah, see you guys later. 
us. I can see us holding hands, walking on the beach, our toes in the sand. I can see us on the countryside, sitting on the grassland side by side. You can be my baby, let me make you my lady. Girl, you amaze me, ain't gotta do nothing crazy. See, all I want you to do is be my love. So don't give away my love. So don't give away my love. So don't give away the love of a woman that can take you. Baby, you don't know what you do to me Between me and you, I feel a chemistry I won't let no one come and take your place Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced Hi guys, so we just arrived at Goddess Cafe And they're about to close in like an hour So we're trying to like quickly order something And get something before they close um, And yeah so hot it's like it's really like humid here like it's so humid but yeah Today is my social. So I don't want to I don't want any copyright, so that's why I'm gonna end this here now. So see you guys. You know? You know I like when you ready to talk to shoot shit, ain't it? Hey, be yo yo, I'm only doing cash, I don't need promo. I pull up to the high rise, I'm in the full fold. Inside Togo. Blue way yonder. Hello. Um, morning. It's the following um, day today. Um, and it's like 6 a.m. We need to head out because our flight is at 8 and we still need to eat and all of that. Um yeah today is the the finale it's the last day here in work and yeah it's been good it's been a good one um so yeah let's head out i'll see you guys when we get to the airport and probably speak to you guys there otherwise yeah <laughs> So guys, I'm back um, at the airport now. We just ordered like food for breakfast. It's from the chicken licking. It's like seven now, and boarding time is at seven forty-five, and it's only seven o five now. So um, yeah, so we're just gonna eat and then um, go check our boarding gate number something. Yeah, and then we're just gonna go in and head out. So yeah, the, that's what's happening right now. Update. I'm looking so cringe. Oh my gosh, like I look so tired because I literally had no sleep at all. Like I look so tired. She slept for like two hours, and I'm running on two hours of sleep. So yeah, explains why I'm looking like this. And my eyes are so 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 small right now. But yeah. Make you wanna change 
So we just arrived in, at the Durban airport. Um, yeah, we're just gonna go fetch the car here, then pay for it because it was parked here at the airport. Um, and then we're gonna head back home. I am so bloated, like I'm feeling so uncomfortable right now. And I'm so tired. Um, but yeah, those are the vibes right now. So yeah, at least we're back home. We're home babies. <laughs> but yeah, it was good, it was good, it was good. I'm feeling very awkward because like, I'm just in the middle of nowhere and doing this vlogging shit, but yeah. Hi guys, um, so as you can see I'm home now, just came back, um, I'm just gonna take a quick shower, focus, I'm just gonna take a quick shower and then after taking my shower, I don't know where to look, Am I looking at the right place? Let me look at the lens. Okay, anyways. Um, after taking my shower, I'm going to update you guys on my whole weekend because, wow. And I haven't had a good weekend like this in a while, you know. So, um, yeah, I just have a lot to say about this weekend. So, after I take my shower, um, more often I'm done showering. And then I'll talk to you guys to update you guys on, like, what was actually happening on my weekend. Because as much as, like, I was trying to vlog, but, like, I was also just trying to, like, be in the moment and um, absorb everything that I am um, hearing. And, um, yeah, you know, so it was very much hard vlogging. But, yeah, we'll explain that when I'm actually telling you guys about my weekend. So, yeah, let me shower. And then um, after showering... You guys, I'm very ready. Okay, it's not that deep, but like in this era that I'm in right now, it is very deep. And we're just gonna talk about that like in a few after I'm done here. So yeah, guys, just an update. I'm home, home safely, and yeah, God is good. So you guys, I did say that I will give you guys an update on like how everything was. Um and what was actually happening um so when was it um i think i heard about this conference like when i think four months ago if not three months ago um yeah and my mom was like do you guys want to go like obviously asking my sister and i if we wanted to go to this conference and to be honest i didn't even know Ukabelo. like i didn't know her like that i didn't follow her on instagram I wasn't even sure about i wasn't even sure Woody, what is this conference going to be about but i just knew like anything my mom suggests for us to go to is always like a good thing always very fearful always very um much needed so i was like yeah i want to go actually i want to go so um yeah so that was like two months ago maybe two months from now or three months from now i'm not really sure and then we decided that we're gonna go to this conference and um it was happening in pretoria so that's where the actual conference was happening so um yeah you know um and then a month down the line a month ago or something yeah a month ago I was like actually i really need this conference because i really have been feeling very like distant from god um distant from god I'm, I'm i was very hungry for god um i've been going through a lot it's as you guys have seen that i haven't been on the youtube i haven't been on social media because there's just been a lot that's been going on with me and i've just been needing god um during this time of my life you know so the thought of um um obviously my mom suggesting that you guys should go and all of that 
it was very much like oh my word because working on my relationship with god and like i feel like god needs me god misses me and i feel like i'm back now like me and god are like you know so i was like oh my word i, I can't wait I, I can't freaking wait like i can't wait to go to this thing you know so yeah booked our flights done everything bought tickets um bought tickets and then it was time to go let me just moisturize my lips because they're looking kind of on the camera but they're not even that not moisturized so yeah i was like mm, i want to go you know so booked our tickets did everything and i was pretty much excited um i'm in such a me era of my life like a very much of like focus on yourself era very much in a peace era like i just want peace surrounded by peace um and also very much in a spiritual era like it's not even an era this is my life forever now like i'm never turning back from god not even turning back from god because it's not like i turned my back on god it's just that i wasn't I wasn't I was very distant you know so I'm never doing that ever again like now it's it's this and better this and better my relationship with God is this and even more better so yeah so we went to this event guys it was um, held in Pretoria um, at Hillsong Church um, um, we booked a flight for like 6 a.m. so we arrived there at about um, what at that like half half nine because like we had to take a car train from from um the airport to um from the airport to pretoria um and then we also had to change get ready and all of that um but luckily like we lived with our clothes like wearing our dresses so that we just had to put our heels on and all of that so yeah we went there um the speakers were amazing everything was just much like yo I needed this you know when you're at a place and you're like how am I I'm, I'm, I'm at my spot like this is my spot I wish this can happen every month every month not even yearly I wish this could happen every month because guys like wow what a wonderful event like I literally like I think this weekend has been like the best weekend I've ever had in a minute in a minute i haven't had a good weekend but this weekend was much needed yeah so we get there um now i'm seeing that oh actually like it's more like a church con not a church conference but it's it's giving those vibes you know this spirit and i mean there's praise and worship there's speakers there's um um speakers that pro um that prophesies um, um there's what there's like very powerful spiritual people um, with very powerful words and very much um, like everything that I was hearing is something that I needed to hear you know even went and um, went to the front just to get prayed for um, someone felt something for me which is something so good which I could, like I literally felt like oh my gosh I, I felt the Holy Spirit guys I felt the Holy Spirit it was amazing I felt like you know what I wish I could just like sleep here and this can happen like every day, maybe. <laughs> and then um, we tried out some new spots in Waterkloof um, in Pretoria. Very cute. Very cute. Yeah, we just had waffles because like we ate at the conference. So we were like kind of full, you know. Um, we went there, just a mini catch up session, um, mini reflecting on like the events and how it was um, with my sisters. Um, and yeah, and then after that, we took the Khao train back to um, Johannesburg and went back home, um, basically my cousin's place. And um, my cousin took us out and we had like, um, we had like an amazing weekend. Like what an amazing weekend. Like I haven't had like a weekend NJ in such a long time. But yeah, guys, like what a good weekend. Um, I'm in such a great space, like great space. Um those close to me will know those who follow me who have been seeing that i haven't been on socials will know um that i haven't been in a good space um and um i just decided Uguti, um in all of those not good spaces or spaces where i hadn't put god first you know i hadn't put god first and like i just realized Uguti, you know like that was the flop that i did because obviously things happened because 
I felt like I wasn't involving God as much when I needed to involve God. So, um, yeah, like I've been in a very, 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 well, I was in a very, 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 yo, very bad space. Um, I'm much better now. Like, yo, guys, I'm much better now. And even thinking about it, it's like, it's making me so emotional. It's making me so emotional because, like, I can't believe I actually got out of that space. Yo, guys, like, I, I can't believe God actually took me out of that space and I'm alive right now because everything just felt so impossible at that moment to go see Jay. I don't ever think that I'll be fine, you know. So, um, <sighs> let me not crack. Cut the cameras. <laughs> Cut the flipping cameras, okay? Um, but yeah, guys, I'm so much more happier now. I just, I don't need anything that's going to disturb my peace. Disturb my peace. Um, and yeah, like, Yeah. <laughs> I hope you guys really enjoyed this vlog. Um, and yeah, this is it from this vlog. Um, I know it's very much short. Um, I wish I could literally give you guys a glimpse of like everything so that you guys could feel like you guys were there. But um, yeah, <laughs> it is what it is. Sorry guys, I had to cut on my camera. Please don't forget to like, to comment, to subscribe. And till next time, my loves, bye.